Hi grade 7 students, in this video I will explain the operations, multiplication and division with monomials. Let's begin. Multiplying and dividing monomials. First, multiplying monomials. When you multiply monomials, you will need to perform two steps. First, multiply the coefficients, numbers. Second, multiply the variables. Keep the base and add the exponents. As you know, a exponent m times a exponent n. Keep the base a and add the exponent m plus n. Let's go to the first example. 3x times 4x. First, multiply the coefficients or the numbers. 3 times 4, we get 12. x equals x1. As you know, x1 times x1. Keep x. 1 plus 1, 2. So the answer is 12x squared. Another example. 2x squared times 4x. 2 times 4, we get 8. x2 times x1, keep x, 2 plus 1 is 3. So the answer is 8x cubed. Another example, minus 5x2y cubed times 4x4y squared. Let's go to the multiplication sign rule. Look here. Same sign, we get positive. Different sign, we get minus same sign we get positive different sign we get negative what is the sign of 5 minus what is the sign of 4 positive plus minus times plus we get minus so minus times plus minus 5 times 4 equal 20 the answer minus 20 let's go to the variables x2 times x4 keep x 2 plus 4 6 and y cubed times y squared keep y 3 plus 2 5 so the answer is minus 20 x6 y5 another example the coefficient here is minus 3 and here is minus 7 minus 3 times minus 7 minus times minus we got the plus 3 times 7 21 x cubed z squared times x cubed y squared z squared variable x keep the variable x base x and add the exponent the exponent here is 1 1 plus 3 4 same as y keep y 3 plus 2 5 keep z 2 plus 2 4 the answer is 21 x 4 y 5 z 4 21 x4 y5 z4 another example here we have three monomials the first monomials minus 2 m square n second minus 4 m cubed t square and third monomials minus 5 m n exponent 4 t5 first minus 2 times minus 4 ti times minus 5 minus times minus we get the plus plus times minus we get minus and 2 times 4, 8. 8 times 5, 40. The answer is minus 40. Let's go to the variable. m2 times m cube times m1. Keep m. And 2 plus 3 plus 1, we get 6. Same as n. n1 times n4. Keep n. 1 plus 4, 5. Same as t. t squared times t5. Keep t and add 2 plus 5, we get 7. So the answer is minus 40, m6, n5, t7. Second, dividing monomials. When you divide monomials, you will need to perform two steps. First, reduce the coefficients. Second, keep the base and subtract the exponents. As you know, a exponent m divided a exponent n equal a m minus n keep the base n and subtract the exponent condition a different than zero as you know a in the denominator first example 15 x 4 over 3 x first 15 over 3 we get 5 x 4 over x 1 keep x 4 minus 1 equal 3. 
The answer is 5x cubed. Another example. The coefficient here is 20 and here is 5. Divide 20 over 5, we get 4. x cubed y over x squared y4. x, 3 minus 2, 1. x1 equal x. Since the exponent of y in the denominator is greater than the exponent of y in the numerator, keep y in the denominator. Keep y in the denominator and subtract 4 with 1, we get 3. So the answer is 4xy cube. 4xy cube. Another example. Minus 45x squared y squared z cube over 25 x y 5 z cube okay see the division sign rule same as multiplication sign rule same sign we get positive different sign we get negative first minus 45 over 25 minus over plus minus over plus we get minus divide bo both sides by 5 we get 9 over 5 and x squared y squared z cube over x y 5 z cube z cube over z cube cancel x2 over x1 x2 minus 1 we get 1 y4 5 uh, in the denominator the exponent of 5 5 is greater than the exponent of y2 uh, we keep y in the denominator and subtract 5 and 2 we get 5 minus 2 3 multiply minus 9 over 5 with x over y cube we get minus 9x over 5 y cubed another example minus 35 m cubed n4 over minus 28 m7 n cubed the coefficient here is minus 35 and its sign is negative and here the coefficient is minus 28 and its sign is negative negative over negative we get positive same sign and divide both sides by 7 7 7 or 35 5 times 7 28 4 times 7 cancel 7 with 7 we get 5 over 4 because minus over minus we get plus with this back to variables m cube over m 7 7 is greater than 3 we subtract 7 with 3 we got 4 and 4 greater than, than 3, we get n in the numerator, and subtract 4 and 3, we get 1. and 1 equals n. So the answer is 5 over 4 multiplied by n over m4. 5n, 4m4, this is the answer. Thank you.